Do taxes matter for growth? Hi, my name is Bradley Kent and I'm a Master of Economics student in the Department of Economics and Economic History. I will be presenting today on the impact of taxation on sustainable economic growth in Sub-Saharan Africa. So, does the level of tax matter for growth or is it the composition and structuring behind tax which is more significant? Moreover, is there a threshold at which tax collection may be considered growth enhancing and beyond which could be considered negative for growth? There is a known relationship between taxes and economic growth. However, this relationship is to be considered on a case by case basis because output levels are determined by individual capital and labor ratios of respective countries. In my research, I will be looking at Sub-Saharan Africa because of the similarities between these countries and their emerging economies, their opportunities for growth, and the fiscal structuring of their countries. In order to guarantee economic sustainability in these regions, there needs to be the following. Wealth redistribution, a minimization of social inequality, and a further evening out of the burden which is placed upon economic agents. On to my methodology. The core method will be an econometric panel data analysis, which will assess the impact of growth over time and the implications of the various tax fiscal measures on growth. The method will reveal if there is in fact a threshold at which tax enhances economic growth, and furthermore, what is the specific composition of tax collection which proves to be more sustainable. The research will make use of publicly available data sets from the IMF, the World Bank and the United Nations databases. My key variable will be GDP growth and my independent variables will include, but are not limited to, tax as a percentage of GDP, corporate personal income tax, international trade, goods and services and export taxes, as well as government expenditure as a percentage of GDP. Additionally, I will be including a non-fiscal variable such as gross fixed investment to further give insight to the research. I'm currently in the methodology stage of my paper, but once this is completed, the findings will be tested and analysis will be made accordingly. Therefore, I look forward to testing my theories and completing my paper. Thank you.